My name's Marcus. I've been training Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, which is a ground-based grappling fighting system for about five years. I train in London on average three or four times a week under Ray Stevens and Roger Grayson. Since I began, I'd heard of this guy called Eddie Bravo, who in 2003 developed his own unique style of Jiu-Jitsu. When he first began, he was called a maverick, a renegade, fraud, revolutionary, fool, or a visionary. Over the years, his system has been proven to be a highly effective fighting style. I changed my gi for a white rash vest, flew 5,000 miles from London to LA to train with a master. The plan was to fit 15 sessions into five days. Six o'clock, I'm off to LA to do some Jiu Jitsu. Going to first class. Escape now. Session two for today. It's hot out here, so I'm gonna go and find my salad bar, rest in, and then back. Four o'clock session. Oh, yeah. Seven o'clock, just finished session three. Absolutely knackered, not skating at all. I'm walking back to the house, absolutely snangled. Four sessions finished. I am knackered. On the way here, I was aching from the 6:30 a.m. session. I've got to get some sort of protein in me. But bedtime, bedtime. Who's that cleaning the mats? Eddie Bravo. Knee belly skip. 
from both sides. He captures that corner and he sits back. Start from the wall and come this way like this. Day four, session eight or something. I think I've picked up a couple of words of the language. Like, don't do it like that, Marcus. What the hell are you doing that for, Marcus? And you should really not do that anymore. This is epic. This is epic. I studied the videos from last night's advanced session with Eddie and started to make sense of the language I'm using. This morning, I kind of kept up with the warm-ups. Inspired with this guy called Ben. It turns out it's Ben Saunders, UFC. A lovely guy. <laughs> the legs okay this morning. So now this is a five o'clock beginner session. I feel quite at home here. <laughs> session just one hour basics arm bars from guard triangles from guard I feel fantastic now two hours and I'm back here again for ready start rolling this is the first time but I've left a session early just because I was wasted I just ran out ran out of energy it means I've got to stretch out that arm a lot tonight 
or else I'm not gonna make it back in tomorrow. Whatever I was expecting, I'm a little bit disappointed. I came to learn jujitsu, and I've learned jujitsu. So why are you disappointed, Marcus? Well, I've rolled already, bravo. That's, that's the bit that people recognize. What did Eddie teach you? Well, he told me to put my leg this way and not that way. Oh, that's what I came here for. Opportunities there, just do it. Doesn't matter what it, whether it's difficult, expensive, put yourself in a different situation, put yourself somewhere difficult, but be ready to listen. And if you've got people around you who truly love you, they will support you, help you. Doesn't matter if they understand it or you want to do it, they help you do it. 